Welcome back to some more, uh... What is it, this? Octopath Traveler. There we go. That's what I was looking for. We're gonna head up to Clearbrook. Try to get another member of our party. So, I think that is over in Drishway. Almost missed this chest here, actually. But yeah, last time we, uh... We finished Primrose's little story. No, uh, oh, yeah, do this. See if maybe they're weak to daggers? They sure are. Okay, let's go. I'm guessing not spears or bows. We probably would have already tried that. I'm ready. Victory shall be mine. My turn to not quite enough to kill it before it could attack, but that's fine. That's not gonna be too bad. There we go. We got a longsword, didn't we? Yeah, we got a longsword from, uh... That one guy who's like, was a real big jerk. Equipment. Uh... Iron sword. Longsword better? No, nope, it sure is not. Okay, fair enough. Let's see. Nothing else it seems. South Clear Book Brook. That's where we gotta go. Jeez, this is starting to thunder pretty bad. Ooh, chest. Maybe, yeah, around this way instead. Yeah. A snail. Snails and bees. Uh, Alright. Ooh, we should also, uh, Primrose got some level, so we should look in her skills, see if she can get anything. Maybe an AoE? Dark attack? Maybe more buffs? I don't know. Something. Snells don't like getting stabbed by daggers, fair enough. Uh, ooh, okay. And the bees are vulnerable to swords. What about some wind magic? No? Doesn't look like it? Okay. Uh, you know what? Here you go, old brick. Take that. And I need you to just, like, slash them all up. There we go. With each battle, I grow strong. Okay. So... Skills is what we want to look at. Here we go. Augment, uh... Single allies elemental attacks for two turns. It's not bad. This is a single allies physical defense. Basically, I would want to use that on Ulbrick also. Uh, deal dark damage to all foes. That's pretty neat. Increase allies speed for two turns. What's well, so that's just higher up. They uh they take their turn quicker. See, this is what intrigues me. Cause a curious effect to occur one time. I think I'll grab that. See what it does. It might be completely useless and spin a point and what have to spend 20 skill points on it or is it 25? It's something tie. But either way, I'll try it out against the Toadman. What to do? Uh, you should rest. Because that will help you out a bit. There we go. How about you? <laughs> Everyone's weak to swords. Lovely. I'm ready. Let's try this. Here 
Oh. <laughs> Fantastic. We can only use that on ourselves. Jeez. I bet it has like some crazy stuff too, like it can buff up every one of your stats or something to that extent. I definitely want to want to rest in the next town, find a, the inn so that we can get all our SP back. But Tressa, you know, she can she has like permanent SP, which is fine, which is fantastic. You know. Oh jeez! <laughs> the battle is true. I'm ready. I can't believe that did no damage. That did like zero, actually. Not a zero, but that took our SP to zero, is what I'm trying to say. Can't believe it did that. What an ability. The first time we use it. Uh, did we try? Yeah, we tried this. Try the bow. I don't know if we. Okay, apparently, either we did or it doesn't matter. Let's go. Getting some more levels. Uh, West Clear Book Brook Traverse to Clear Brook. What's up here, though? What's up here? Probably nothing I want to go to yet. That's fair enough, but. A good day, oh, just the snails. So what do you not like snow? Are you good with you're, you're fine with bowlers. I'm ready. Jeez. There you go. No. Hit him with a level slash. I'm ready. How about you? Nothing. Everyone doesn't care about anything besides the sword and deck. And the snails regenerate? What? I am ready. I was unaware of that. Stab the snail. There he goes. He's dead. Maybe we don't even need to uh to go rest up. Great, lovely. It's a good day for battle. These noises they make. Stop, frog guy, stop. What's the difference between these two frog people? Nothing. Okay. One seems slightly stronger than the other. I'm guessing they're still I both weak to swords. Down. Yes. Here I go. Yeah. I'm ready. I keep forgetting about that, huh? Ah. So I'm gonna use that ability again as soon as I get some SP back. I will cut you down. And I could just uh could just like give a potion for it, but that that'd be more. We'll level up here anyway. Uh yoink. 
another olive. What do we have here? Boulderfall and Clearbrook. Alright, let's go to Clearbrook. May I now then. Jeez. There are tons. There, why are there so many different kinds of frogs here? Just use a level slash. Whatever, way. it'll interrupt two of them. I am ready. Alright, let's do it. Uh Dance had no effect. What do you mean the dance had no effect? Let's do this! <laughs> what do you mean it didn't? Do some damage to all of them. That works. I'm ready. For doing it again. What is this ability? You know what it is, and it's good. Oh yeah, we can't use it again because it costs 25 this SP is truly to do nothing, take our SP down to zero, and do a tiny bit of lightning damage. I'm ready. I just stab this man he did no damage. Oh, he's weak to bows. Fantastic, I can work with that. With each so big boy frogs weak to bows. Clearbrook, welcome. Welcome to Clearbrook. Home of the clearest brook in the lands. Oh, what is this? We have a lot of options now. A steel axe? Ooh. Not for sale. That's... How do, how do I get that? Oh, can I steal later on? With one of the people? I know one of them's a thief. Alright. You fight this lady. He day. runs up, yells, a battle! Victory she screams, Out of my way. <laughs> Jeez, you're hitting harder. No. Harder than I am. There you go. Not a fan of spears, Victory though, are you? I'm about to do my... Super spear attack. Jeez. Uh, the thrill of the fight. What a thrilling fight. A fine fight that was. You have my thanks. And she's unconscious. Fantastic. Granddaughter's possessions, a silver hairpiece. Ooh. Ooh -hoo -hoo. Don't mind if I do. Always looking for a bargain. The grandfather's cough is getting worse, but he still won't give up that pipe of his. Oh, I forgot that's how the uh, the doors work. That's so cool. Uh, where's the inn? Over here? Well met, traveler. What can I do for you? What would change your party? Restore reputation?
What is all this? Here a tell. We don't. Okay. It's a lot of stuff I don't have access to yet. Oh, here, here's what we need. Nina's brother is the best apothecary in the entire village. Can I buy stuff from you? Little child? Nothing that I care to buy. Okay. Oh, speaking of caring to buy, well, we got a... What you get? You should probably have something. You're kind of low on that defense stuff. Max SP, oh man. You can use that awful ability you have more. And then still use something. And still be somewhat useful. You need a shield of some sort also. What is this? Protective earring. Elemental physical damage. Yeah, you have, like, the lowest out of everyone, so you take that. Albrick doesn't have great elemental defense, but, you know, look at the guy. What do you have for me? Fantastic. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, general store. Ooh, 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 arcane knife? That's so much better than yours. Give me. Yes, equip it immediately. No one can use axe. These are pretty good shields. Alright. Let's buy two of those. On you and you. Let's buy headgear for... Yes, for you two, since you just got equipped with one that gives you more SP. And then a bronze vest for you. The bottom two, all brick and primrose. All right, you guys should be able to deal with like everything now. Um, so let's go to our equipment. Okay, and this stuff is just to sell. Gotcha. Sell two of those. Yes. Long swords definitely don't want any of those. Iron spears, we're already better than that. What do we have? We have four spears. Little baby dagger, yeah, get rid of that. We have an arcane knight. She has like the best weapon out of everyone. All right. Okay, let's go. Was it Alfin? So this is our next boy. 
Zephnina, you better hold on for me. There ain't no way I'm letting that venom beat you. You hear me, Viper? I'm coming for you. His name is Alfin, and he is an apothecary. His whole life has been spent in the pastoral village of Clearbrook, where he looks after the residents as a young apothecary. He is not alone in his efforts, though. Zeph, his best friend since boyhood, works alongside him. But when Zeph's little sister is bitten by a deadly viper, it falls to Alfin to fashion an antidote before the poison takes her, and so he ventures out to the cave of Rio, where he must do battle with the dread beast. He will need caring allies on the path he has chosen. Yeah. Hear the beginning of his tale, please. Save him with that medicine of yours. You betcha. Just sit tight. Bam! That should do her. Drink it down slowly now. Well, I'll be. Thank you, my boy. <laughs> Don't mention it. Just doing my job. This will stop the coughing for now, but your lungs have seen better days. Try to give the pipe a rest, sir. Here? Oh, Elfin, thank you ever so much. How blessed we are to have an apothecary like you in our little village. It's not much, but please. Nah, it's on the house. Why don't y'all hold on to that and buy something tasty for you and your grandpa? I'll be back to check in on him, okay? In this age, the arts of medicine and healing are still in their infancy. With disease and illness rampant, the people rely on salve and tinctures fashioned by apothecaries. Is that it? Tinctures? Mama. Did you see me, Ma? I whipped up an anti tussive elixir like you wouldn't believe. Can't believe it's been a year already. Am I any closer to being the man I want to be? The man he was. Ow! I've been looking all over for you! Hey, is Eth. You done for the day? Yes, only two patients today. Having you around sure eases the burden. I could convince you to quit giving out discounts. Oh, come on. The poor gal has enough trouble looking after old Alec. I can't very well take what little she has. <laughs> I'm just teasing. You know that's what I like about you. If the villagers are healthy and happy, that's more than good enough for me. <laughs> Couldn't have said it better myself. We may be new to this, but between the two of us, this village is in good hands. Sure is. Plagues, epidemics, bring your worst. I'm counting on you, Alf. We all are. Who'd have thought that little troublemaker would turn out to be a top-notch apothecary, huh? 
We can't all be born with a silver pestle in hand, Master Seth. Your mother would be proud. Maybe. Anyway, I should be getting back to Nina. Yeah, beat it. Head on home, big brother. Uh, hey, Alfin. We've been friends ever since we were small, right? I know you better than anyone, so be honest. You're keeping something from me, aren't you? Um... I'm right, aren't I? Alf, the truth is... Master Zeph! Master Zeph, you must come quickly! It's... It's your sister! Oh dear. These look like bite marks. Alfin, could you take a look as well? Hmm? Ah. Oh. <laughs> I read that and I was like, oh yeah, they've already said it. She's fallen into a deep trance. This is worse than we thought. <sighs> Indeed. Nina's the only family I have. If I lost her, I'd... Mm. <sighs> Wish she could tell us what happened. It's safe to assume she was bitten by something poisonous. But what? Without knowing the nature of the poison... Yeah, the wrong medicine could make things worse, and quick. Damn it all! What foul beast did this to my Nina? Let me ask around. Maybe someone saw something. All right. Alfin can inquire and learn all sorts of information from people. Can you now? Lily, friends with Nina since childhood, the two have grown up like sisters. The rather more the rather more strong willed Nina often takes a lead on their secret adventures into the dangerous wilds outside the village. Fantastic. Come on now. Bite marks on Nina's leg. You sure you don't know where they came from? Um. Huh. I want to help your friend, but I'm an apothecary, not a miracle worker. If I don't know what bit her, there ain't nothing I can do. But. Oh? You want to help her too, right? So just tell me, please. Nina wanted to pick water blooms for her brother. I wasn't so sure about it, but I went with her to the cave. And she got bit. She got bamboozled. By a giant snake. What kind of snake? Was it black? Tell me it was amber with blotches on its back. Yes. Oh, it sure is that one. Holy. A blotted viper. And she's already dead. Sorry. Sorry, I know we're not supposed to go there. But Nina wanted to be a surprise. I see. Alright, well that's all I need to know. Your friend's dead. Sorry about that. 
maybe should be more careful. Uh, don't you worry anymore about that scary snake, because I'm gonna go deal with it and hopefully not get bit. Nina. Good gods, man, a blotted viper! Hmm. Nasty critter if there ever was. Uh, this ain't good. Might as well go get started on the hmm. grave. Time is of the essence. The poison is spreading through her veins as we speak. We must prepare antidote with all haste. But we, but we need why. the poison. Yep. There's supposed to be a nest of vipers in the cave of Rio. So I need you to go in there all by your lonesome. Along with plenty of other nasties. Well. I know, but what choice do I have? It's either this or start digging. I'll leave at once. Look after Nina for me. Hold on now. Oh, ho, ho, hold up, buddy boy. I'm gonna go. <laughs> I'm the one with the death wish here. Plus, I I don't I don't I don't get along with children, even if they're dying from venom. Uh, I'm responsible for you know I won't let you risk your life. Uh, uh, uh. Don't worry about me. I'm gonna go. Do Just a it. minute. Oh no, Seth, where are you? Ah! <sighs> oh no, she's not dead. I'm I'm here, I guess. Oh, how sweet. <sighs> See, Zeph, you gotta stay here, and I gotta go be the hero. <sighs> Alright, just just don't get all dead. And that's how I got here. So I have a day with this viper, you see. We just met, and you still want to come help me? Shucks, friend, I owe you one. They're good folks in this village, down to the last. Zeph's always stuck by my side. So, gotta stick by his, even though his sister is an idiot. So let's go, we're heading for the cave of Rio. Just east of the village. Better hurry. Okay. I can do that. Oh, you don't have like anything to say? Hello, can I fight by or talk to you? Ooh, a hidden item. Ah, uh, this old woman was carried to Clearbrook by the whim of fate. Much like the waters of the river she watches over, perhaps in... What is that? Perhaps she hopes that in time, it will cleanse her of a lifetime of sin, of banditry, of murder, or of worse. Or perhaps she seeks only to live out her days in quiet damnation. Nice chatting with ya. Where's the hidden eye? Oh, boy! Fantastic. Can I fight you now? No. You're too old for that. I can buy your stuff. Five. Five monies? Sure. Always looking for a bargain. Can I allure you? What is this? Oh. <laughs> Reputation with the town will suffer if you fail. 5%? I'm good. Primrose, you gotta work on that. You gotta work on getting the elderly ladies better. None of your party members can open this? Why not? What's the deal? Hello, friend. 
Iron vest. Yeah. Ooh. Alf. What weapons do you use? How do you even fight? Do you throw potions at people? Axes. That's why we're getting axes. Fantastic. Ordinary hat? No, no, no. That won't do. That just won't do at all. Well. Looks like I gotta go back and buy his stuff. How much? We have some money. Okay. I can do that. I guess. Getting so many party members have to buy everyone's stuff is just... Ugh. Such a pain. Alright. Oh, jeez. We're, we're getting to about time. Uh, arcane hatchet. I don't... Do you do elemental stuff? Jeez, I don't even know what you do. Skills, let's do this. First aid, oh boy. Ice damage. Yeah, okay, cool. Yeah, you do stuff like that. No, we want to go to buy. We want to get a... Not a cleaver, because that's 8,000 money. Alright, so we want to get one of these arcane hatchets. Yes, here you go, Alf. You want to get a, a shield. Here you go. We want to get a, a hat and a bronze vest. There you go. And a bronze vest. And look at that, suddenly you're ready. You're, you're up here with the rest of us. The cool kids, as I like to call them. Can I get information from you? No. Can I get information from you? Discount at the end. Fantastic. Can I alert you? 80% chance? Yeah. Pray come hither. Fantastic. Hopefully she won't die somehow. I don't know exactly what this uh, alluring thing does, but hopefully she won't die. Oh boy. Okay, so let's go over here. Let's save real quick. Look at that. Look at this party. We're starting to look like like an actual gang of people. Alright, well, that's gonna do it for this part. And uh be back with more very soon. Cause I'm I'm still playing this.